Hey guys, it's Carolyn here with the Hillside Market. Today I wanted to feature our most recent build, which is a small three by six uh, DIY backyard greenhouse. This chicken coop was built with backyard type uh, chicken grower or chicken producers in mind for people who are looking to have like three to four birds to get a dozen eggs a week type of thing, just enough to feed their family. Uh, this coop has quite a few bells and whistles and I wanted to take a chance to show you guys all of them. I will take you for a tour and I hope you guys like it. Let me know what you guys think. You'll notice that there's wheels on this little chicken coop and as well as a handle on the front. The intent is not so much to mimic a chicken tractor because chicken tractors are fairly light. This is more just to make it movable. It will take two adults because it is still quite heavy but this way you can move it over and clean under it and this will allow you to have easier access for doing that. Starting on the bottom, you'll notice that we have a access door on the front with a turnbuckle. Inside you'll notice the ramp. The ramp is also on a pulley system. This allows you to close up the run and keep the birds either in the run or in the coop. Uh, while you're cleaning inside the coop or if you're moving your whole chicken coop to clean the actual run portion. One of my favorite features about this chicken coop is the feeder. It is mounted on the outside and it's easy to fill up, um, but it automatically spills out onto the bottom for the chickens to have access to the feed. You might be wondering why the coop has these gardens on the side. Um, this is actually going to be used as growing space. There are holes drilled through the bottom so the water will be able to drain through. My plan is to put about an inch um, of rocks along the bottom on both sides, medium sized rock, and that will also again improve the drainage. And then I'll place pots on top of the rocks uh, with flowers and probably some like lettuce and things that I can feed the chickens to. Because ventilation in a chicken coop is so important, we included windows on both sides. If you are familiar with the Hillside Market, you'll notice that these windows are exact replicas of um, what you see on the petunia. So again, turnbuckle design to prop your windows open. And inside the windows there is chicken wire so that your birds cannot escape from your open windows. Inside the coop, the chickens stay nice and warm thanks to a heat lamp. They also have four feet of perches inside, which allows them extra or lots of room. So everybody is happy. We've also included an openable roof which allows for extra ventilation in the summer if required. You could just prop it open. And also for, again, ease of access for cleaning or if you need to change out your heat lamp or things like that. For easy egg collection, we have a hinged lid onto the nesting boxes. And then for easy cleaning, this entire nesting box swings open. Well, it looks like this coop is everybody's favorite. We've got the dog, the cat, and the birds over here. We really did try to make sure that this chicken run and chicken coop had everything that your hens would require. Uh, we really do believe that we've got all of the boxes covered and that your birds will be very happy. And hopefully they will give you guys your dozen eggs a week that you're looking for. Once again, my name's Carolyn. This is the Hillside Market. Thank you so much for watching this video. If you're at all interested in this DIY guide, check out my website or my Etsy and you'll find it there.